Reaction Fox News legal analyst Greg Jarrett and former acting attorney general Matt Whitaker. Gentlemen, both, thanks for being here. Uh, Greg, let me start with you. Axios just reporting a couple hours ago that Mac uh, Kevin McCarthy says an impeachment inquiry would require a House vote. Now, Nancy Pelosi didn't hold a House vote either time uh, in the first impeachment or the second, which was a snap. What do you make of McCarthy's insistence on a, on a vote, and does it change the process? Well, it does change the process in a meaningful way. I mean, M McCarthy, it, it seems, is going to be fair. You know, there'll either be a House inquiry committee or a select committee. Um, it'll have both sides on it. You'll recall in the first impeachment of Donald Trump, uh, secretive hearings in the basement of the House. Uh, Republicans were allowed to attend, but that's about it. They weren't given subpoena power. They couldn't call their own witnesses. They were limited uh, and restricted in cross-examination, so it was essentially a sham. And then they didn't vote out of the committee, but it simply went to the floor where Democrats had the vote. The second impeachment was even worse. They didn't even bother to hold in any hearings. It was a snap impeachment. Um, here, I think McCarthy is determined to be fair. Matt, you've been at the highest levels of the Justice Department, the highest level of the Justice Department. How common are government officials using one of them, which is a .gov account, a couple of more Gmail accounts, um, pseudonyms, alternate email addresses to pass information inside government or to others like Hunter Biden? Yeah, well, it's good to be with you, Pete. And, yeah. you know, regular order is always the most important thing. And I know when I took over at the Department of Justice, that was, you know, my main mantra was regular order. And I'm glad to see Kevin's doing that in the House, uh, unlike Nancy Pelosi, who exercised sheer politics, as Greg mentioned. Now, the pseudonym thing is very interesting because, you know, typically, you're, you know, it's, it's known that the principal has one of these uh, accounts so that they can conduct business without, you know, all the spam that's going to come in at the highest level. It's the Gmail accounts, and it's also the multiple accounts that's very concerning in this case. And obviously, we're just scratching the surface right now, Pete, on these m multiple thousands of emails that, that the vice president was sending uh, to Hunter, his son, including information and unknown and not classified, but certainly sensitive information about Ukraine and other topics that Hunter was certainly very interested in for business purposes. For sure. And Greg, uh, this regular order, uh, as Matt points out, uh, it gives the power to whether it's a select committee or an impeachment inquiry to subpoena these records. Are they going to see unredacted these emails? Would they see unredacted bank accounts? Would they have a chance to actually get to the bottom of it, hence a war room being assembled in the White House at this point? Yeah, I, I mean, look, uh, yes, they would if they use a select committee. Uh, they would have absolute authority to obtain unredacted alias emails, 5,400 Joe Biden was using over eight years as vice president. <laughs> That's more than two a day. And so I think in there, you're going to find some pretty astonishing information about how Joe Biden uh, was working with his son in these influence peddling schemes. And, you know, you played a clip of it a moment ago. He laughs it off. Uh, well, bribery is an impeachable offense in the Constitution, and the yes. Burisma scandal alone contains compelling evidence of influence peddling, which the criminal codes describes as bribery. You know, using your public office to confer a benefit in exchange for money. And Burisma in Ukraine notoriously got a benefit courtesy of Joe, an investigation that suddenly vanished uh, when he demanded the Ukrainian prosecutor be fired. In the meantime, his son gets millions of dollars in return. That is the definition of bribery in the criminal codes. It's right there in the codes. It's right there in the Constitution, Matt. But if you turn it to other channels right now, it is wall to wall, 18 mugshots, Atlanta indictments, hearings, cameras in the courtroom, Donald Trump, Donald Trump, Donald Trump, as it often is. How much legal jeopardy, though, are the Bidens actually in? Should there be an, an, an inquiry that connects the dots that so far kind of cable news and a few House committees have had to connect? I mean, to what, to what Greg said, I mean, this strikes to the heart of what it means to be the president, what it means to hold classified information, to use your influence. Um, how far would this go? 
Well, it can go a long way, and it's going to be the deliberate drip, drip, drip of a impeachment inquiry that is ultimately going to do the significant damage to Joe Biden and his presidency. Because if you remember uh, the, in Watergate, it took a long time for that case to build, and a lot of shoes had to drop. And I think in this case, uh, in particular, you know, as Greg points out, there's a prima facie case right now for bribery. And as they build this impeachment inquiry brick by brick, I think we're going to, the American people are going to learn a lot more about what Joe Biden was doing as vice president and how involved his son Hunter was as the bag man and as the person negotiating these deals so that the whole family could be enriched and their lifestyle could accelerate well beyond, hmm. uh, you know, the 40 years of, of public service that Joe's lifestyle had provided to that point. Pay very close attention to when rank and file Democrats in the House or the Senate start to pay attention and say this is something worth looking at because there's enough smoke. Uh, Greg and Matt, thanks for breaking it down. Hey, Sean Hannity here. Hey, click here to subscribe to Fox News YouTube page and catch our hottest interviews and most compelling analysis. You will not get it anywhere else.